I put out a video yesterday that the Morris Miner is finally done. I've had this car since, I'm going to say just June. The beginning of June, actually the very end of May. I've had this car, and now that it's finished, I don't know what to do. I mean, I'm going to wire up the lights properly, because... If you notice that thing hanging down from my mirror there, that's my only source of lights. But I'm going to wire the lights up properly, and um, then I'm just going to drive it around. Like, because we have this fairly large yard that goes way up farther than you can see. And it also goes really high farther than you can see. So I'm just going to drive it around there when I have to, like, feed the cows or something. Um, but, I have, maybe I've got another car. I don't know. I mean, I'm thinking of getting a, uh, Wildfire WF120V, which is a Chinese electric car. It's really weird, hard to get parts for. <laughs> and it's a two, but it's a 2009, so I'm not so sure about that. It's too new for me. Um, so, I got this car from a very nice car dealer, Cars Under a Thousand, in Mine Hill, New Jersey. I'll put a link to their website in the description of this video. Uh, they got some pretty cool stuff. I think right now he's got a Mercury Topaz, which is really, really cool. Uh, and then he has like a, he's got a, he used to have, no, he has a Ford Flathead. Or the one with the uh, chrome nose, you know, like the Studebaker. It's got the thing in the grill. But he has one of those and a Grand National. So check him out. He's, I'll put the link to the website in the description of this video. It's a pretty cool cars, and I got a pretty cool car from him. So I am very proud to own this car. Thanks for watching. I will do monthly updates on the car. This was the first one. Thanks for watching.